uh, it was New Year's Eve. It was it was gonna be New Year's Eve, and uh, I wanted I wanted a pizza so um, so that uh, me and my girl could sit in my apartment and have a romantic dinner. I don't <laughs> I, I don't maybe pizza is not romantic. But there were candles, but 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 it was New Year's, so I didn't I didn't know if there was gonna be a a, a place to to get a pizza, you know, which because maybe some places were closed. So I called the place that's right up the street and sure enough they were closed so you know I, I called this place uh, a few blocks over um, so I, when I call them you know like it's an automated call and they say well you know which place are you calling push this button are you calling the one on Sunset are you calling the one on Hillhurst so I was calling the one on Hillhurst and that like there's like you can make your order online and I would thought oh, I don't know, order a pizza online you know that I think is is that what people do now they order a pizza online I, I, I must be getting old if people are ordering pizzas online I don't want to order a pizza online but anyway so the the they finally the phone rings and it takes a long time it, it rings and rings and rings and and they they pick up the phone and I you know I say uh, how late are you going to be open and they're like, well, we're, we're going to be open till 11. I'm like, okay, great. I'm going to try this new pizza place. They're going to be open till 11. I'll set it all up and I'll go over there and I'll get the pizza. So it comes time uh, for me to order the pizza. So I call them and I go through the, the phone again. Do you order online? Do you want to order online? No, I don't. Which branch of the pizza places do you want to go to? And so I, I find and then the phone rings and it just rings. And it rings and rings and rings and rings, and they never pick up. So whoever I called earlier, who actually seemed pissed that I called um, to order a pizza, because I get you're supposed to order online. Um, they, he didn't know they were closing. So I don't know why I didn't think of it in the first place. So I called this other. Uh, place it's more like a family restaurant that's what you know Palermo's on Vermont so I'm like oh you know because I'm like what am I gonna do and I'm, I'm looking through my phone which has like five pizza places in it and uh so I call Palermo's no automated system they they answer the phone I'm like wow someone answered the phone and uh I said you know can I order a pizza uh, to come in I want to come pick it up they're like yeah um what do you want? I tell them the pizza I want. And uh, they're like, okay, uh, what's your name? I tell them my name. And they're like, okay, it'll be ready in 20 minutes. And I'm like, that's it? They don't want to know my phone number. They don't want a credit card. They don't want me to go online. And I was strangely moved. Like I felt like, uh, like these people like they trust me, <laughs> they trust me enough to buy a pizza from them that they don't need my phone number and my credit card. They don't need me to go on the internet and order a pizza with a fucking app. Uh, I can just call them, they'll make me a pizza and then I go and get it and then I pay them for the pizza. I don't know how that's novel. But uh, it took me a while to digest uh, what my dissatisfaction was with the previous, like trying to order pizza and thinking about doing it on an app. But I missed the human interaction. I missed someone saying, yeah, I can make you a pizza and then you could pay me for this pizza. And you know, I trust that you're gonna come and pick the pizza up because that's the business and that's our agreement, that's our bond as um, humans. It was a great pizza.